All I'm wondering is how, if this is how you are, if this is how, you know, er, the water level in Earthworm Jim gets you, I can't imagine how you'd get to, um, the game that is Iron Lung. Iron Lung? Yeah, so Iron Lung is, like, a game that everybody started talking about last year, and the plot of that game was you play as a criminal who is locked in a very bad... A pretty much already decaying as hell sub where you have to navigate through latitude and longitude to take photographs of this literal space planet that is full that is that entire ocean is filled with blood but here's the thing that makes it creepy one you literally can't see anything because you have to navigate through the coordinates that are given to you basically like how an actual you know uh, god damn it do Oh, but Fuck off. there's a, not you. A, no, no, no. Uh. But there's also the fact that in the game you can also you are being followed by something that's in the ocean with you. It's creepy and it's actually really damn good. Jacksepticeye, Markiplier did let's plays of it, and Pyrocynical did a really good video discussion of it. Uh huh. But it is very... But you do have to kind of go through a lot of trial and error just to kind of find your... Ouch. Trust, just to go through the coordinates. Because like I said, you can't see anything in the game. The front of the of the, of the the uh, submarine is blocked. So you basically just have to use like X and Y axes just to kind of map your way out. It's a good game though. Oh, just son of a bitch. A lot of like backtracking. And the asteroids. Yep. Mm. Ouch! There was I, also the I, I, Sam and Max cartoon. Yeah, I'm not surprised that had a cartoon. Yeah. Although, because the fact that Sam and Max was a lot more um, <laughs> vulgar in the games... They had to dump, water I, it down. Yeah, they made it so completely different, but it was still incredibly funny from the clips that I saw. Ow! Son of a bitch. I will say this, after two brace, this stage is a ton of fun to play. Okay. You're fucking bungee jumping and taking on a giant booger. <laughs> that is so goddamn 90s right there. Yeah. It's a giant Ouch. Oh god, his head doesn't snap. Good. Oh, your screen share's acting up. Discord is just acting up. Earlier, I like I was out of the call for a bit. Yeah, it's been acting up too. I'm guessing it's something with um. It may just be Discord itself. Ah! Oh! Wait, was I it... bit in half or did I just? My rope probably snapped. Oh, so Chad, um, Golden's been starting a new little hobby. When I when have I not started a hobby? <laughs> <laughs> I, I was leading it in for you to talk about it, but yeah, Golden's getting into Perler Beats. I, I think I've talked about getting into Perler Beats before. Like, I don't expect to do anything great out of it. I just have some fun little ideas to work with, and they may turn into, like, big projects. Um, it's, it's mostly for Creative Hour. I was suggested to do, like, a stream where I'm sorting together... Because, literally, when I had, like, um, a whole bucket full of Perler Beats, all the colors were mixed together. So trying to sort it out, it's going to take a really long time to do. And, it, and I know some people are into those kind of satisfying organizing streams. Oh, people are going to love that. So I might do that tomorrow morning. Yeah. Let me ask you. Go ahead. What's your, like, S tier fast food fry and what's, like, F tier? Like, best fry, worst fry. As fries in general? Um... <laughs> Yeah, from fast food places. And Chad, you can answer this yourself too. I would have to say the top one would be In-N-Out. And the bottom, um, God. I guess it just has to like, because there's different forms of fries. I just, I don't like uh, wedges. I think that's what they're called. They're big giant fries. I like the ones at KFC. Aww, wedges are good. Teach their own and I got <laughs> bit in half. <laughs> Funny enough, 
Like, I'm not counting in and out just because it's a regional place, but, like... It's gonna be more universal, um, in the I, next I couple know, years. Like, for now, you know. Um, of the ones that are available, like, all across the United States. I think my number one is Wendy's. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. controversial opinion to some. There's a lot of people who hate Wendy's fries. And, um... I do not like McDonald's fries. To me, they're too salty. Wait, Arby's has fries? Oh, yeah, Arby's, yeah, has, Arby's has fries. Oh, curly fries. Yeah, curly fries. Oh, you know what? No, no. Um, you know what? Wendy's doesn't get the S-tier fries. It's the waffle fries at Carl's Jr.'s. Oh, yes. <laughs> Does Carl's Jr.'s go by another name? Because uh, uh, it's a... Hardy's on the East Coast. Yeah, so if, you have, if you've uh, if you eaten Hardy's or Carl's Jr.'s, then the waffle fries are, like, S-tier. I don't even mm. like a lot of... Uh, Carl's Jr. food, but the waffle fries, I will always have waffle fries. Oh, absolutely, yeah. And, like, yeah, there's that. I love the curly fries at Jack in the Box. Come on! Jack in the Box and me don't get along. Yeah. Jack in the Box has this stupid grudge with her stomach. It's, so. it's whatever particular grease that they do that the stoners love that my stomach does not. <laughs> I mean, that's you... understandable. That, that, that... Mascot with the giant uh, with the giant head has it out for me. <laughs> Jack has it out for you. Go, Fred, go. Avoid the chicken nuggets. <laughs> <laughs> they always look like chicken nuggets. They do. I, oh, damn I, it. I can't say which is S tier for me. I would have to say maybe rallies. And F tier is Burger King because Burger King's fries are too goddamn salty. Yeah, yeah, making your own potato wedges is good. I like like the most potato things, but fast food potato bitch. wedges are too soggy for me. That's the thing is that you need to have them like fresh, fresh, so they still have that crisp exterior. And that's the hardest. Oh, thing I lost. That's the hardest thing with most French fast food French fries is that by the time you get home, they're they're squishy, which is why I like the yeah. water fries because because they're such a thinner surface area, they stay crisper longer. I can see it. Un Controversial opinion, the fries from Chick-fil-A are pretty damn good. I wouldn't say that's controversial. Chick-fil-A has some pretty good food. Well, Chick-fil-A is good, but bring them up to anybody and they're like... Chick-fil-A because they're homophobic. I'm sorry, yeah. what? Yeah, I'm people are very homophobic. <laughs> Yeah, Chick-fil-A's um, CEO has donated a lot of the money from Chick-fil-A to um, Anyways, a lot of cool to a lot of um, anti-LGBT groups, which is why whenever you bring up Chick-fil-A, everybody gets. Why would you bring that name up to us? Well, this this CEO must be one piece of shit. He. I mean, he is basically one. For me, I still like Chick-fil-A, but I understand why people are completely against him. But at the end of the day, it's a fucking chicken rest. It's a fucking fast food joint. Why that is kind of true. Out? I think it's kind of silly that they would want to just... Because that also li like limits like any customers coming by. It's just... There are just some things that some people are just letting their own grudges take hold of their lives. And it's really dumb. Yeah, I mean, and I've, and I've seen people always say, oh, but there are better chicken places than Chick-fil-A. I'm like, then why are there so many lines at Chick-fil-A? Like, earlier today, Dad and I went to go pick up some KFC, and we passed a Chick-fil-A, and there was already a giant line of cars waiting to pick up their food. <laughs> so, they're not doing anything wrong with their food. It's just the, pe it's just the people in charge. Mr. Beast burger is good. Never had Mr. Beast. Mr. Mr. Beast is in like the YouTuber Mr. Beast. Yeah, because apparently back then with I think it was um, at one point. Wow, Discord, you are really being a dick tonight. Discord hates you. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Is it working now, at least? There we go. Now I can speak here. Mm. Yay! But I was trying to say, Mr. Beast did have his own burger at one point. Mm-hmm. But I heard it was pretty average. Oh, this part's a bitch. It's like when McDonald's was doing the weird, like, burgers for celebrities. Like, you had the, staff, the Travis Scott burger. You had the um, BTS burger. 
Ah! They're also, so unpredictable and where you're they're coming! Chicken Express. I feel like there was Fuck! Chicken Express in my in Sorry. my um No, you're fine. Chicken Express. Is that what I think it is? No, nah, I've never had Chicken Express then. I think it was chicken now. Excuse me. I love yep. that. <laughs> Yippee! <laughs> oh yeah, that was the place. I like your food. Wait, what? I'm not restored to my full health? Come on! Oh, that blows. Yeah, that blows chunks, man. Jesus. Also, give me a quick minute. I'm finishing up the laundry. Fuck! Oh! Oh, God! I hate this part! Oh, at least I went past that. I just need, I need a fucking checkpoint because I don't want to do this again. No, 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 no! Damn it! Come on! Why'd you have to do that? Now you have to do this all over again. Ow. God damn it. Stop. Oh my god. God damn it! Ugh. Fuck! Ugh. Oh, come on! Checkpoint! Oh my god! I was about to fucking lose it. Death? Is is he beer bean? Oh, that was a pit. Well, son of a bitch! Piss off! Oh, they're just gonna keep popping out. off oh. no no oh shit oh, damn it Stupid looking balls. <laughs> yeah, they are. They are looking balls. Oh, I gotta think of plasma. <gasps> oh, hello. God damn it. Tap you there.
Nothing there. Ah. Are you doing laundry? Oh. Oh. All right, well, I guess I can't go there. Ow, shit! And checkpoint! Oh, shit! Nope, 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 nope. I'm back. Welcome back to the land of the living. I was wondering where you went. Sorry, I did say I had to go beer because I was finishing up laundry. Ah. Yeah. Originally, I was going to try to start earlier today, but then mom said she had to do laundry, and then my sister was like, I need to finish half my laundry, so... Ah, that was fun. Especially when the first half of my laundry didn't dry. Uh, I, kn I know how infuriating that is. Yeah. Oh, but fuck I'm... off, stupid green eyeball thing. Looks like something out of a tool album. <laughs> Anything with eyeballs, yeah, it's a tool I album. Mean, I mean, that's literally everyone's response. Whenever they see something with eyeballs, they're like, tool? It's, it's one of two things. Oh, shit. Go through all this again. Fuck off, stupid hopping brains! Go away! Oh my god! Finally, they have, a, they have a thing for you, which is why they're stalking you. And now it's just literally <laughs> him without his body. Yep. Thing for you. That's a Hinder song. I've got a thing for you. My cousin, the next room. Sometimes I wish she was you. I guess we never really moved on. That song gets a stupid amount of hate. Like it's it's, it's cheesy. Cheese. Yeah, it's cheesy. It's trying to resemble the 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 sound of the '80s. But apparently, there's. Some people say that the song is about cheating, which, okay, if we're gonna complain about that, you might as well complain about your love by the outfield. Josie's on a vacation far away. Come around and talk it over. So, so many things that I wanna say. To say. Yeah, and yet people love that song, but they hate on lips of an angel because it's also about cheating. What? Or all the fact that apparently, oh well, they're a they're like a so, they're like a band that's so dumb. It's like you might as well say that about every other band out there. Jesus Christ! I really wish you can duck and shoot. Actually, I think you can. Oh, you can't! Stop throwing your potions! Get out of here! <laughs> I wouldn't even call you a mad scientist. You're a stupid scientist. Wasting their experiments and shit.